So a warm welcome to you all. We will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. And here we have Real Betis against Atletico Madrid. I'm Peter Drury and providing analysis and expert opinion alongside me will be Jim Beckley. Glad to be here, Peter, and I'm ready to rumble. That's got things on the way. Perez. Guardado. Looks like a good ball through. And what a start! Oh, you've got to say, the odds on him missing from there were very slim. Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. Real Betis have an early lead. Good start. Played out to the wing. Tries a through ball. He's made sure that that won't get through. And the ball's come loose and the chase is on. He scores! Two up, too easy. How many more to come? Uh, he was never going to miss from there. Oh, Peter, you can't teach that. You either have it or you don't. His anticipation is on another level to everyone else's. Superb. Real Betis get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Passes it through. William Carvalho gets into some space. Goes for goal! They are rampant! They're looking to run away with it. without reply this is becoming a stroll Real Betis scoring two goals in next to no time Perez did well to step in there that was more than necessary Guardado Perez It's anyone's ball. Carvalho floats one over. Saved it. Danger averted for now. Perez with a beautifully timed run. Witzel tries to get it forward quickly. It's 
done well to tidy up the situation. Guardado could complete a hat-trick here, Jim. What do you reckon? Well, I think he's got every chance, and he's got plenty of time, too, to get his third. And the way he's gone about this match, he looks very much like uh, he could even end up getting more. He's full of hunger and running. Montoya. William Carvalho could try cutting inside here. In with a header! Decent attempt, but not quite good enough. And the whistle goes for half-time. It's looking very much like game, set, and match. A half of ruthless endeavour with a thirst for more. Just in case you think this is bias on my part, it isn't. This is fact. Real Betis very much in control here, three up and cruising. Montoya. Perez. Looks to slip it through. Perez. It's come loose. It is a corner. Loose, who's getting there? Stefan Savic gets good distance on it. And that will sail harmlessly past. Well, it was far from high caliber, Peter. And when you're shooting from that position, it, it needs to be just that high caliber. He put on quite a show there. Well, he went at it with great confidence, and it's not going to stop him from trying again. Jimenez. And it's Griezmann. Memphis Depay. This defence just doesn't trust itself to, to play a higher line. Frightened of people getting in behind. Yeah, absolutely. It just opens up the opportunity of not only strikers getting behind, but the runners from midfield too. Now the pass. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Witzel. A loose ball. Guardado is now the subject of some adhesive marking. Yeah, and the fact that he's registered, Peter, simply encourages more attention of um, of a, a closer nature. Good running with the ball. Can they build on it? Griezmann with the ball through. Keeper's ball. Goes wide. Perez looking to get on the end of this. Defense has got rid of that. Aimed long and direct. Tries a through ball. Loose ball. Who's going to get that? Going after it. And that's a throw. -in. Atletico Madrid, their final change. Carrasco. It's Carrasco! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Board shows there will be three extra minutes. Carvalho. 
lovely bit of skill. Chance! Can he finish? It's come loose. There is the final whistle. What a great day for attacking football. The artists have painted their pretty pictures. Only one team in it.